All right, this is winner's round one. We're going to be having Demon versus Puffy. A.K.A. Puffy Knight, the winner of the last tournament. This is Demon's first uh, game in a tournament in this community. And they've elected to go with Pokemon Trainer here. We got ourselves a Pokemon battle. Puffy Knight has decided to go with the Puffy portion of his uh, name and is choosing Jigglypuff. Won a couple of games last tournament using Jigglypuff as well. So far, things are looking pretty good for Demon. At least they were looking pretty good. But you gotta hit those techs. If you miss the tech, try to get up attack as quickly as possible. But generally, you just try to hit your techs. Especially since, like, Squirtle is going to, like, never be able to live with the rest. It's gonna go for another up there into rest. No, we go for the regular rest. So you can't fastball while you're in hit stun. But if you had used like a up air or a forward air, one of your fast areas, and then press down on the control stick, and you'd actually get to the ground faster. Because if you were just a little bit more hurt, then you actually would not have been able to uh, punish that with uh, Flare Blitz, because Jigglypuff would have woken up in time. Jab, yep. Oh, but he messes up, but then you mess up. <laughs> the super armor going through. Nice. Alright, you brought it to last spot. That's pretty good. Three hits. Alright, you could have punished a little sooner than that. And I don't know if 10% is the best you can do. But rewatch the, the gameplay, and when the third bubble appears on your shield, that's when it's safe to start attacking Jigglypuff, because it only has three hits on it. And it only hits on the ground as well, so like you can jump after the second one, and then punish as well. If your character happens to be have a better punish with jump. My instinct to side be betrayed me. Well, I mean, I do say this all the time, that you know, the better players aren't going to get hit by it. Because literally every time I'm fighting Charizard, the only thing I'm thinking the entire time is, you know, put myself in a position, like I'm literally intentionally putting myself in a position where it would be a good idea to Flare Blitz. And then when they Flare Blitz, I just press the shield button, because it's frame one. Yeah, it's pretty difficult to hit a Sleeping Squirtle, because um, it's very low to the ground. What do you do? You go to the movie? Alright, this should be a... Okay, I'll, if, I, if it were me, I would've gone for a forward smash in the other direction. You need to like play for a week, not trying to win or like improve in any way other than just like hit your text. When you, instead of landing on the ground, it's like press the shield button and then you don't like crumple like that. In that case, hitting a neutral tech would have actually gotten you killed. So it's actually kind of a good thing that you missed your tech there, but it's not really. Like, you could just tech roll and it would do the same thing. 
The other thing you could learn to do is uh, to A land. So in the situations where you would normally need to tap, you just like, you know, up air instead. Like right before you're about to land, you just up air. And it doesn't take any lag. Now you're dead. You should have been dead. You're definitely dead now. Should have been dead. <laughs> you're, you've been giving a lot of leeway here. Because PK wants to get a particular kill on you. You're dead. the final game that we've got for the tournament. Puffy Knight moved on 2-0 uh, over Demon.